Hey y'all, my name is Courtney Burks and this is my first YouTube video. <laughs> I'm so silly, I'm so sorry. So I'm creating this YouTube channel really is basically, um, I want people to come along to see my life. It's not really that great. Well, it is. Let me stop lying. It's a lot better than what I make it out to be. But um, the first six months are really the first year that I'm going to be doing my YouTube channel. I really want to help people who are um, trying to lose weight in college and how that can be a real life struggle. Like um, college campuses don't always have the best um, healthy food options to uh, match with the academic abilities that we need to have. Y'all can tell I'm in school. Look at them words. Um, so I basically want to help students, um, you know, achieve goals um, by losing weight. Um, the first thing I want to talk to you all about is that last month I actually did a trust test trial. Um, in February basically trying to see if this is something I could really commit to like was I really serious about trying to lose weight or was this just another new year new me type thing that I wasn't gonna commit to but I really was committed um and last month I lost about 10 pounds um I could have lost more but I had some medical things that popped up and it kind of hindered me from moving forward but um yeah, and so basically last month I um, I worked out three times a week. I was eating a lot healthier. I cut out a lot of the fried foods, so no fries, no pizza, no sweets. The only sweet I will say that I did eat was Jello, and our Jello comes with whipped cream on it. So sometimes I would take the whipped cream off, but sometimes that whipped cream was just you know the little niche that I needed. And a lot less pasta. Our school really has pasta like maybe twice a day for lunch and dinner. And, you know, that's a lot of pasta. You know, that's definitely going to go to the places that you don't want them to go to. Um, I substituted that for drinking a lot more water. This is my water. <clears throat> my water jug. <clears throat> Sorry. That's my water jug. I drink... What's going on with that? But I drink my water with apple cider vinegar in it. Um, uh, I put just a little bit, as you can see, it's a lot in here, but I usually just put a little bit. We try to wake up in the morning and eat breakfast. Um, as college students, that's really a struggle because we stay up late nights and you know we barely make it to class on time. But really eating breakfast kind of um, and really big breakfasts make a huge difference. I kind of felt better. I was more tentative in class. Like I was mole. <laughs> so anyways, um, my third friendly tip would be to, for me, I have, I live on a very, very small campus. Our campus is 55 acres. Like I said, I'm in New Orleans, Louisiana. Party city, Mardi Gras, beats. <laughs> <laughs> but most people that I do am friends with and know drive to class walk to class it is okay to walk to class if it takes you 30 minutes you already know you're not going to work out so if you utilize that time and make that your workout time that's even better and also you know a part of this friendly tip as well is don't take the elevator take the stairs you know take the long way up that makes a huge difference, like a huge difference. Um, you may be a little bit more tired, but it's okay because, like I said, if you're not used to working out, this utilizes more opportunity for you to work out without working out. Um, let's see, what else did I do? I had a workout partner, friendly tip number, I'm thinking three or four. Either or. Uh, I had a workout partner. Make sure that you have somebody that is very equally yoked and just as driven as you are. And if you're not, understand who your your workout partner is. My workout partner, which y'all meet her next video. Um, she's She has a lot more on her plate. So her motivation is kind of um, geared in different uh, directions, I can say. But me, I'm like, okay, I got a lot going on, but I need to lose this weight. So, and I want to be healthier, so I kind of have to push her, and sometimes 
I'll go work out without her. You know, I'm not dependent on her, but at the same time, it's nice to work out with her and have that encouragement. So that will be the fourth tip that I will have. And then um, those things intertwine really help me uh, utilize losing weight like seriously like i lost the first 10 pounds and really like they said that's water weight but like for me i was just like i didn't feel like it was water weight like i felt like i was really losing weight and people were seeing i was losing weight so it was like you know it kind of gave me motivation and you know more um endurance and then i kind of did things that i like to do you know, um, if you're not somebody that likes to go to the gym, don't go to the gym. Like, I wouldn't advise anybody. Like, don't do things you don't like to do and expect to get results from them. Um, maybe you like the park. Walk around the park. Do things that kind of mentally don't make you feel like you're working out. Like, because some people just don't like working out. And I completely understand that. Um, you know, it kind of gave me motivation and, you know, more um, endurance. And then I kind of did things that I like to do, you know, um, if you're not somebody that likes to go to the gym, don't go to the gym. Like, I wouldn't advise anybody, like, don't do things you don't like to do and expect to get results from them. Um, maybe you like the park, walk around the park, do things that kind of mentally don't make you feel like you're working out. Like, cause some people just don't like working out and I completely understand that. Um, just do different things that kind of, you know, make you happy. Uh, go dance and do Zumba class. A lot of people like dancing. Um, any type of martial arts, Taekwondo. Um, even playing music is a workout. Those instruments. Um, I'm trying to think of other things. Like, I know that sounds crazy. Like, playing music is um, a workout. But, I mean, you see Alicia Keys' arms, her arms, you know, they be looking like Michelle Obama's. But, um, anyways, that's really all that I had to lose weight. Alrighty, so you all can see that this is my goals for March. Alrighty. And so my first goal is to be 220 pounds by the end of this month. So March 31st, 2017, we're going to do a weigh-in video and see if I accomplish or if I miss the goal. My next goal is I have a nonprofit organization called Community Queens. Make sure you follow us on all social media at Community Queens and like us on Facebook. Um, I want to launch our website so people can actually see what we're doing. And my last goal is to launch this YouTube, which I can now cross off. And this is really um, important that you all have. Make sure that um uh something in your room that shows that this these are goals that you're trying to accomplish also something that you can have is sticky notes like this is of course my youtube channel um i want to help call it students losing weight i want to lose 15 to 20 pounds a month don't eat after 8 p.m and support system my nonprofit organization community queens Monthly outreaches, Queen's Conference, a Queen's Closet, and we only see a seed giveaway. This is also things I have for my academics. So make sure that you all take care of that. And then my vision board for this year is Berks 2017. On the top right, right here, you see I want to go to Cosmo this year. This year I want to launch a YouTube channel. I want to pay off my debt. You see the picture of the two women mural themselves. I want to lose weight, of course. The cruise that's going to Cosmo. On the bottom middle one, that is me going to Miami for my 21st birthday. Hopefully that comes true. And lastly, getting my passport for the first time. Also have little encouraging things like these chalkboards that I have. I got those from Target for like two dollars. Um, those things really my heaviest was 250 pounds. I was really never a skinny girl. I was more of a thicker girl with a lot more thickness than other people. But um, I would definitely say that, you know, now I am 200 and some pounds. <laughs> I'm not really comfortable yet just expressing everything. I'm getting there, guys. So just kind of, you know, work with me. But like I said, this is really a channel for me to show my journey and show everything that I'm doing and kind of 
bring you along with me with hopes of helping um within the next couple of videos i'm gonna show you you know how you can utilize your meal plan and people that are behind the scenes for your betterment um talking to um personal trainers um we're just going to utilize our campus resources for the betterment of your weight loss. Make sure that you stay tuned. So, like I said, my name is Courtney Burks. I'm in school at Dilley University. Um, I have 18 credits. I have a nonprofit organization. Um, I have a life. And I completely understand how hard it is to lose weight. So, I definitely want you all to take on this journey with me. So, make sure you all follow me on social media. Uh, Instagram, Miss underscore Burks. That's B-I-R-K-S. On Twitter, it's Miss underscore Burks. Um, right now, it's K Burks 18 And Snapchat at K Burks. <sighs> make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And see you next week. Oh yeah, also, <laughs> I'll be posting videos every Sunday. Sundays are the days that I'll be, um, actually, I lied. Mondays are going to be the days that I post my our videos. Those are, you know, the best days for most people to start a new habit, a new challenge, a new um, thing within their life. So like I said, make sure you all like, comment, and subscribe, and see you next Sunday, Monday.